No, not a VIP. Alright, stop, collaborate, and listen. Cray Tan is a brand new monster legend with a bunch of skills. Lightly, skills not be able to pick so lightly. Will I pick a skill? Yo, I don't know. Turn off my brain and I flow to the extreme. I pick my skills, pick up my runes, and something really fail. <laughs> I think it's settled. Remind me never ever to rap or attempt to do that ever again because I'm just not built that way. Sorry. Hey guys, as you can see from our last video and just now me showing you a screenshot, we won another race. Yes, the race last week. Sorry, it's been late, but you know, I've been busy. Anyways, I know what the biggest question you guys are asking because the prizes for this race were amazing. And the biggest question is, what did I get for Christmas? Well, I bought gems. Uh, just kidding. Uh, anyway, uh, well, I really did buy gems. Anyways, Cryotin. Is he good? Well, yeah. It depends. You, you, you know the saying? It's, it's not the size that counts. It's how you use it. Well, uh, it, it, he's the same way. It's, uh, it, it's, it's not the size of him that matters. It's how you use it. Or him. Or... Yeah, I'm just gonna go straight to it. So, Crichton is slow. That is one thing you need to know about this guy. He is slow. In terms of his life and power, they're decent. They are up there with, you know, um, fellow legendary monsters, but the man is slow. But he is faster than Oros, at least. He has a tanky trait, so he is immune to stun and freeze, uh, just like majority of the tanks in the game but his skills beg to differ he has some amazing skills that could one hit kill a monster um he also has very controlling type skills like a mega freeze aoe and a mega freeze solo so um and he also has a taunt so depending on what you pick he can play multiple roles um what i'm going to show you in this review is the tank roll because I like tanks and I really don't like Oros so I'm hoping that this monster would be the replacement of Oros. Warning! Some of the skills will be pronounced in a very weird manner due to the fact that the names are very weird so make sure you look at the video because it will be very weird if you will just listen to what I'm saying because they are very weird. Thank you. The first skill I want to talk about is called Busale Montes. I apologize if I said that wrong, but it's Busale Montes. This is an AOE Mega Freeze. I apologize in the video. I was too lazy to record another one, but he missed. But the guy's already frozen. Anyways, um, it is a Mega Freeze. 98% chance Mega Freeze, uh, which means even though the monster is immune to freeze, Mega Freeze will bypass that and freeze the enemy. And this will freeze is effective for two rounds. The only the problem is it uses up 250 energy I mean look at the energy of my monster it is just nearly empty and he has one stamina ruin um, for this tank build I use one blue one green and one orange uh, for speed so um, that's the tank build I know a friend of mine he uses um, a rainbow build as well but he chose more of the damage and less more efficient energy or the more standard energy choices for powers the next skill I want to talk about is Eboya. Now this is one of my favorites. I think it's very useful for a boss fight that has massive HP. Um, but once again, uh, it has a mega freeze uh, for a single target, 98% chance. Uh, the cool part is this person also has a delayed kill. Um, that means on the third round, uh, this guy is instantly dead. Uh, <clears throat> a good strategy for a team up here is to use someone like Angenica to get rid of all the traits that a boss has and then use Eoboya to um, put the delayed kill on the boss and then all you have to work on is surviving for three rounds. Now you may not get the most stars but at least the enemy will be dead. <laughs> The next skill I chose is the Olympus. This is nothing new. It's a taunt. Uh, it gives a 100% life shield to itself. Um, that means this taunt will protect a single player, a single target attack, and it'll go straight to him. That's it. The next skill I chose um, is something that I will always choose for every monster. If there is a skill 
that gives you an extra turn, pick it. Um, so I picked Scotty from the skill groups one, Scotty, Skatey, whatever it's called. Um, but it returns 25% of your stamina, which is very useful, including after you're using that very drainy um, power skill. Uh, this is useful to regain some of that stamina and it gives you an extra turn. Uh, so either you could prep for another taunt or you could do another mega freeze for instant death if that cooldown is already down. And so that ends Cryotin's review. Oh, I forgot to mention, yeah, he belongs in the Evil Legion's book, the Winter book, and the Family's book. So, uh, including the current war that we're in right now, he is a very useful monster to test out if you have him with the race. Anyways, that's me signing out. Oh, one more thing. I would like to speak on behalf of Team A of KK here, everyone in our team would like to thank all the subscribers and all the new viewers for watching our YouTube channel and I hope all of you have a happy holiday.